the road up ahead, down the white line highway, into the night. There are twists and turns along the crossroads of life, places we never expected, places we never imagined, places that around that bend is another choice and another life. If you're not careful, you too may not even notice that you have also entered your own diversion. Thank you. What for? I have no idea, but thanks anyway. Bye. Bye. And it's me. I'm going to be late. I'm in this terrible traffic. No, it's me again. Oh, for this is ridiculous. Yeah, it is, isn't it? I'd uh, give up on it myself. So you're um, stuck in all this as well, are you? Stuck? Yes. And late. For anything important? Lunch with an old school friend. Anne? Anne, yes. We haven't met since college and we meet up for coffee and this. Typical. Yeah. Life runs that way sometimes. Yes, it does. So, um, what are you going to do then? Well, I would ring her, but... You keep getting through to me. Exactly. Talk to me then. Why? Tell me your rose. I don't know you. Well, perfect person to unburden them to then. None of it's ever going to come back and haunt you, is it? No. No, it won't. So, um, you hadn't seen Anne for? Oh, years, literally, since the last day of college. Do you know, you always mean to meet up, but then. <laughs> well, then you just don't. I know that. I'm terrible for it. Oh, and me too. Yes. I mean, after this call, I'll be meaning to get in touch again. Oh, I know. Obviously, I'll worry about it for a while. I'll be hurt. <laughs> the rejection will destroy you. You may never leave the house again. <laughs> I'll die all alone. Impoverished and unloved. And all because you never called me again. I seem to have this effect on men. Oh, no. It's not your fault. You don't do it deliberately. I don't. And I'm so glad you understand that, because many men don't. The poor wretches. Left devastated in your wake. I wish I was half as interesting as you make me it sound out to be. I'm sure you're far more interesting than I could ever imagine. No, I'm not. 
What do you imagine? Let me see. I bet you're a mysterious heiress with homes in New York, Paris, and Gustard. Do you love the way that sounds? Gustard? No, I've never thought of it before, but now that you mention it. So, um, what's your favourite place name then? Something that sounds great. Oh, I, I don't know. Oh, the pressure, the pressure. I'm not very good under pressure. Oh, I bet you are. Go on. A name. Hang on. Got it. Uluru. Where? It used to be called Ayers Rock, Australia. Ah, uh, I know it. I, um, love your accent, by the way. Why, thank you. And, uh, are yours? Mine? Mine's boring, I, I haven't really got an accent. You have. And, uh, I think it's quite cute. Cute? I've been called many a thing, but cute. That is a new low. <laughs> it's not. It is. Puppies are cute. Kittens are cute. I'm, I'm a fully grown man. You can't call me cute. Well, what do I call you then? I'm rugged. Rugged? Yeah. Rugged. Okay. You're now officially rugged. Well, thank you. I'm, uh, I'm feeling more manly by the second. And I'm feeling suitably more feminine by the second. I'm starting to feel like a damsel in distress. Cool. Do you um, want me to come and save you? We'll see. Do you always flirt with strangers if we get the wrong number? Flirting? Oh, I'm appalled at the suggestion. I'm um, merely being charming and uh, quite possibly dashing. Mm. And what does your wife think about this charming, dashing attitude? She accepts it. She knows the effect that I have on women. I'm, um, I'm single, by the way. I'm, I am single. You think you doth protest too much? No. I am. Happily single and free. And you? Equally so. Well, what are the odds? Of? With us two, meeting like this. Meeting? OK, talking. The same wrong number three times? <laughs> It was working perfectly fine yesterday and rang me on it. All the spookier then. It's kismet. You think? Of course. I mean, we're obviously meant to be together, can't you see that? The only thing I see at the minute is a lot of traffic. Yeah, me too. Did you know what? What? This could be the perfect chance for us to actually meet. <laughs> oh, come on, seriously. Why not? I don't know you. Nobody knows each other until they meet. We're one step ahead, aren't we? I don't know. OK. What's your favourite film? Favourite film? Favourite film ever. E.T. No, that doesn't work. The correct answer was The Godfather, in case you were wondering. Oh, I was. Your favourite song? Whatever. There's way too many. Just one. Go on, pick one. Michael Bublé. I just haven't met you yet. You see? It's a message. That was a good call, by the way. <laughs> now I'll play your game. Favourite food? Ooh. Curry. You can't beat a good lamp of sander. Sorry, the answer was Italian, but thanks for calling, player. <laughs> uh -uh. You see? See what? We're having fun, aren't we? <laughs> yes, we're having fun. So how about it then? How about what? I mean, we're not going anywhere, are we? No, we're not going anywhere anytime soon. Oh, wait, tell a lie, we're beginning to move. Yeah, me too.
Why don't we arrange for one of us to wait for the other? Um, I'm coming up to a diversion. Can you see that at all? Yeah, I'm a couple of hundred metres away from it. Oh, great. Well, I'm, I'm not far behind you then, so can you wait for me? OK. I'll wait for you. Where? Um, why don't you see if you can pull up near the mouth of the tunnel? The tunnel? Yeah, the old tunnel. What tunnel? The old tunnel, the first one. What tunnel are you talking about? I can't see any tunnel. Well, whereabouts are you then? By the bridge. What bridge? The Golden Gate, of course. <sighs> what? Is that where you are? Where? San Francisco. Yeah, why? Where are you? Okay.